morning, everyone. I hate this time change. I hate changes in time. I just wish we would let it one time, and that's it. Uh, somebody in Congress must get, or in the government, must get a paycheck from doing this so they keep it propagating every year upon us. Open your Bibles to Acts chapter 17, verse 11. We'll try to get there today. Last week, if you remember, really, I tried to give the reasons why I talked about time, time with the teenagers, time, how we set goals. We'll go into that in just a moment. Today, I'd like to give you some reasoning uh, why I tell these uh, teenagers that if you woke up today in America, you just hit the lottery. What opportunities we have in this land. Those opportunities I'd like to see passed down to the next generation and the next generation and the next generation. If you do not, not, do not have a handout and would like one, would you raise your hand, please? You got them last week. Perhaps you weren't here or perhaps you forgot yours at home. Raise your hand. Mr. Ralph's coming up through. Just keep your hand up. If you remember last week, I generally start out or I start out with the teens. Tell them, you know, today is March 14th, 2021. Day numbers. Anybody know what day is? 73. Day number 73. 292 days left in the year. What have you done with the last 72? They're gone. Forever gone. I challenge the teens as I challenge myself. Dreams are only dreams until you write them down. Then they become what? Goals. And if you have no goals, remember, if you shoot at nothing, you'll hit it every time. Sometimes when you set a goal, sometimes you don't make your goal. Sometimes you have a goal of something, whether it's a sacred goal.